Welcome to Ati Joy 721. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Uh, here um, this morning I will be, I'm in my garden. I'm gonna pick, it's already September 10. Fall is coming. Um, next month, today actually it's start cooling down. It's 60, um, I think it was 63, 63 degrees this morning. It's kind of cool already starting to get cool uh, so fall is just around the corner so all these tropical plants is going to um, die when we have a really cold freezing um, temperature so uh, I have plenty of this shisu these are the Japanese uh, Koreans and Japanese eat a lot of this. This is uh, they use this for the sushi when they eat. Uh, also, my Taiwanese friend, she eat this when uh, she cook food. She saute this, and I have plenty of this. I didn't know what to do. Yesterday, I went to see her. She uh, taught me how what to do with this so it won't go for a waste. Uh, won't go to a waste. So uh, I'm gonna pick this put it in the pick a lot of the good leaves uh, so I can uh, preserve it for um, the winter and then the next time I have uh, more plants of this the next year so for now I'm gonna pick the leaves and uh, I'm gonna dry it and uh, preserve it so um, and during me see I have to pick the good leaves I kind of a little bit late on this one I should have done this but I didn't know until I didn't know until now that I can do that so there's a good way to to save this to use it for uh, you know save it for consumption instead of wasting it so this is what I'm gonna do I'm gonna I'm going to pick most of this and then I'm gonna wash it and then dry it and then uh, save it store it in a in a container after it's dried up all right uh, It's actually nice and cool today. I really didn't need this hat. I didn't know uh, I could that. So it's already cold. I'm just so used to wearing hat when I come down, come out here. When it, the sun is already uh, have rise up. So this is gonna be what I'm gonna do today. Here's my uh, leaves drying uh, behind the car on the back seat of the truck. Put it in a clean towel so that it's clean, not dirty, so they're drying. Once these are all dry, I'm going to take them out and then crumble it and put it in a jar. So this is the leaves, the seashore leaves that I dried inside the, 
that truck and um, it drives it's all now very it's uh, kind of crunchy you can eat this just as it is this is what my uh, Taiwanese friend taught me and uh, she let me eat, try some of her leaves that she dried up and crumbled and it's ready to eat you can mix it with your rice uh, steamed rice or you can when you make um, noodles you can also mix it so this is a vegetable dried vegetables dried organic under the sun but it's clean because uh, I put it inside the truck instead of putting it in the food dryer I put it inside the truck and let the sun dry it up no bugs, no dust because it was inside the truck so and this is very salt all I have to do with this is crumble it up and um, ready to eat it anytime I can eat it just like this too It still have the flavor, the original flavor. Mm. It's like you're eating the, you're eating the, the fresh leaves. The taste is the same as the fresh leaves. Mm. You just crumble it like this, and then put it in a jar and. Keep it in the pantry, and when you're ready to eat it, you just eat it. Then on winter, you have all these greens, not cooked, no chemicals added. It's all organic, and not wasting the. The leaves that I've grown from the garden, just from my garden. So I didn't know, I didn't have any idea I can do this. It never come in my mind to do this until my friend, when I visited her, I told her that I have plenty of the plants that she gave me. I grow a lot of them, and I don't know what to do with them. I feel bad because. I have too many and so she taught me she told me what to do with it so I don't waste them and she showed me what she had to let me try it she already have those leaves that dried in her jar and she just let me taste it sometimes because she is a person that loves vegetables in fact she don't like to buy vegetables from the store she grow her own veggies she prefer the organic she's from Taiwan so she's very cautious what she ate she's uh, our previous neighbor good friends of ours from the other house and this is it all ready to eat all preserved naturally preserved no nothing uh it's not cooked so no nutrients was taken away from this because uh, i did not cook this i did not put it in the oven i did not put it in the food dryer I have food dryer but I did not use it because there's the easy way and natural way dry it under the sun get the sun dry it inside the vehicle just park your vehicle in the driveway and the sun gets to over 100 degrees depending how hot it is and this is the result.
or organic. It's all organic. And now I can use this for the winter. So uh, we won't have this during winter time. It's too cold. Or you can buy in the store from from Oriental store, grocery uh, stores, Oriental, and they're expensive. Why would I buy when I have my own? Unless like if I want to make sushi and make I need the uh, the fresh leaves, but of my health I try not to make sushi is my favorite when we were in Japan it's like once or twice a week we go to a, our uh, favorite sushi restaurant we just indulge the the sushi they're so good and I can eat sushi every day but with my health issues, you know, eating too much um, rice, so I'm cutting back. I have health issues, and plus, my favorite sushi to eat when we were in Japan, when we go out to the restaurant, is the shrimp, uh, shrimp with avocado and. Um, the white radish and rice oh that was my favorite i eat i eat it until i'm full those those were the first plates that i will pick until i get my my fill and then i try other stuff that i also like but the first thing i choose is the the first uh, plates I take is the the shrimps. They were they're my favorite. It's probably the reason why I uh, ended up high, high cholesterol now. Now I'm so restricted to eat the uh, shellfish, like crabs, shrimps, lobster. Because I have uh, high cholesterol, so I slow down and I kind of sad because I I am limited to eat those seafoods. So I keep them here. And this is ready to eat. You guys, if you have other uh, green leaves, herbs, and other stuff, vegetables that you can dry up and then dry in the sun and then save it, and then you can eat it and cook it, whatever, however you want to do with it. This is the way. I just, because this is clean, I wash it before I dried it. So it's ready to eat. Thank you for thank you for watching. Whatever your hands finds to do, do it with all your heart and with all your might, as you are doing it for the Lord, not for men. And uh, God bless everyone. Keep safe. Bye. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and click the bell button.